You stupid, you don't get out. You've already been told once before. Your mouth needs to stop. Walk out the door. Yeah, but see, here's the thing about that, officer. Yeah. What I believe that you're doing in following me is that you are intentionally trying to make it uncomfortable for somebody to exercise their First Amendment rights to engage in a constitutional Like prior activity. restraint. I think and we're in, the we're in the First Circuit Court of Federal Appeals, and there's been clear case law on the right of people to film in public places and to not be harassed, harangued, or otherwise intimidated. Uh, by officers uh, in the performance of their duties that are inhibiting or in any other way interfering with our abilities to do this without any kind of fear of reprisal, repercussion, or anything else. Okay. You following me makes me very uncomfortable. And I think there's also a statute in the city of Boston as well as the state of Massachusetts uh, that deals with people who feel uncomfortable when somebody's following them. I think it's called stalking. Annoying and accosting. Right, annoying and accosting and harassing me. So what you're yeah. doing right now is causing me to feel alarmed, threatened, and harassed. And okay. I believe those are the specific words of the Massachusetts statute. I looked it up before I came here. Okay. Well, um, that's your I, opinion. But no, it's not my opinion. I went to law school. Where'd you go? Are you an attorney? I am. I'm asking you to stop following me. Well, I'm not going to do that. Oh, you're not going to? Hey, that's great. Yeah. You're, you're just giving me fantastic comment to make yourself, right. officer, still to look like a okay. bag. That's what okay. you're doing. Fine. So, if you want to look like a bitch bag, you can follow me around. I'm what, co what company? Huh? You filming? What company? Yeah, no, I'm not from a company. We can't be filmed. Come on, do you want to speak with somebody from the, the team? Uh, don't worry, it's a crime team? Yeah, I mean... Yeah, if, you, if the boss is here, if the crime boss is here, I'll talk, I'll talk to him. Yeah. What's going on guys and today we're in beautiful downtown Boston. You can see the old state house over there and I'm with Ron Durbin coming around the corner. Josh and James Freeman. We're going into Boston City Hall. There's some records requests to do. I've been here a couple years ago. They did not behave. Let's see if they've learned their lesson. Respect our rights. Here's the fellas. Now you get the cock angle. Ron is very durbanable. There is Josh Riddle Me This, and then there is James Freeman. That's Bob Police anyway. I don't think that's You pay for it. I'm gonna hang I'm gonna hang back a little bit. Because the police I don't want them to necessarily recognize me right away. <laughs> Touched by an angel. Hello, my name is Officer Angel. <laughs> Where is it? It doesn't say city clerk. It must be on the third floor. I don't know. City clerk's know. office. I got. I got to. Yeah, I'm always on top of it. Man, you're regular. Regularly fucked up. Yeah. I gotta go to the city council. All right. Well, we should probably start on. I gotta go to the city council. Here, let's just start on nine. Start on one. Planning and development. You want to start there? Let's go to nine. And then arts and culture, the deli, budget and management office, consumer affairs, food access. Where's city council though? I just need to know where that's at. City clerk is on six. Mayor's office, uh, city five. Council, so five. So really five and six are the ones that we really want. Oh, we want everyone. We want, well, we, I mean, we definitely want to go to the auditing office. Oh, yes, the and mezzanine. And my gator shoes, those are green. But they were 99 cents. Yeah, push a button, Ron. It gonna be here, man. I don't think that these sides are working. Yeah, no, I think the elevator construction is on that side. That's why we're here. I feel like I'm carrying an axe. You are. If you extend it a little bit, yeah, you Ron Durbin. So difference in security from the first time I came players. here is huge. Bro, they were cool. at, at first they wouldn't even let us through the door the first time I came, so. Oh yeah? The oh, first yeah. time you came? Yep. Hey. Anyway, six years old, she.
Ooh, they must have went this way. For yeah, this is the Persons for Disabilities office. It's you, you're disabled. Here, Mayor's Hello. Commission of Persons. Hey, how are you today? Good, how are you? Good, thanks. Oh, it's a nice office. Resident accessible parking applications for drivers, for passengers. I'll find out which office I'm looking for. Yeah. Do you know the name? Um... Long-haired lady. Hold on, let me. Okay. We didn't get the location. We just got the description, which. Gotcha. We're playing Doctor Seuss. Okay. Yeah. Are you meeting someone in particular? Or just yeah. Like, yeah. Okay. yeah. We're just. It's a. It's a monolith. I mean, the place is huge, so it's like. The Brilla style is. That... City permits. City permits. Uh, what kind of permit? I don't know. Lady <laughs> with uh, short blonde hair that wears a mask and city permits. Any more descriptions? Uh, I mean, there is more description. There's things called names. There, well, there is a, more of a description. What does it say? Maybe she can help us find it. She's a bitch. Oh. I, I mean, I didn't write it. I didn't. <laughs> no. Yeah, there's just a couple different kinds of permit. There's a construction permit, parking permit. I think it might be easier to isolate if anyone fits that description. Is there a short, uh, blonde-haired lady who gives out permits, who wears a mask, who's a bitch? I don't know. I don't do a lot of permits. And again, these are no, not yeah, my yeah. words. I don't do permit work, so I don't interact with permits very often. So okay. Even without that, I don't. I wonder if she has a permit. All right, so maybe you can point us in the right direction. Is there anyone that you know that works in City Hall that could fit that description? I can tell you what permits. The, are. the, the B word. That would be that would be excellent. <laughs> I can tell you the. Because it's not you. You're very nice, and he seems yeah. very nice too. So that does not apply to and you. He's not blonde or a girl. <laughs> yeah, he's not. <laughs> I'll say you have to assume as a gender. It's 2022, Jim. It's 24. Thank you very much. We'll find it. Seven. That lady's awesome. Thank you very much. I appreciate your help. Have a great day. Is there a woman who's got short blonde there that does permits who's a bitch? I'm looking at the Google reviews. I agree. I didn't. Office of Fair Housing oh, and Equity. Airport. 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 Did you go in? Yeah, you say hi. In, but, I mean, just look around. There's nothing in there. Yeah. How are you today? I'm good today. How are you? Well, I'm better now with your smiling face. I smile almost all Director of First Impressions. I just wanted to come say hi. Thank you. And you are? Uh, my name's Josh. Okay. It's very nice to meet you. And Josh, what's your business here I'm just filming and working on a, a documentary. Well, I don't. I can't give out too much information because even a little hint like gives it all away. But I'm just working on a, a documentary about the building and things that happen inside of it. It's it's, it's going to be very interesting. Okay. Well, are you going to ask any of us about what we do at the Office of Fair Housing? Why is there an Office of Fair Housing? What gave rise to the need for fair housing laws in this country? And do you want to tell us? I, absolutely. Okay. Only I've been here four weeks. No, sir. It's, yeah. <laughs> it's true, but I've been a volunteer and a paid person around fair housing for a very long time. Fair housing get, comes from the fact that for a very long time it was legally permissible to discriminate against certain people in the housing market. Mm -hmm. Did you know that? Yeah. That people could actually advertise in the paper, no, no Negroes, no mm -hmm. Irish. Whites Central. only. Mm -hmm. Whites only. Yeah, yep. no children. To this day, we still fight against the fact that some people try to advertise no children illegally. I have a guy in my hometown, uh, not my hometown, but the town that I live right now, I'm running for office, and uh, one of the folks in office tried pushing a guy out because of his um, Jewish heritage. Yes. And they tried to force him yes. out and this so happens. stuff like that. Yeah, I can't give you the statistics yet because, right. as I say, I've, She's only, amazing. I've only been here four weeks. I don't have it all. Um, well, we have quite a bit, a bit of information, which is why I didn't come in asking questions because okay. I already pulled a bunch of information here. But I saw you. You looked like you were smiling, so I wanted to come I say smile hi. smile almost all the time. Well, you have an excellent day. Thank, Thank you so much. Don't push. 
Oh, it's a pull door. Have a good one. Thank you. Human Rights Commission. That's why she's so nice. Crotch cam. Giving something inspirational. Hello. Fuck, fuck, to you, fuck to you. Mayor Abrams. Mayor Abrams. Yes, no questions. No Mayor comment. Abrams. No comment. Mayor, Mayor Abrams. It's all in the referendum. Can you tell, can you tell me when it's when all in the addendum. Nine. Uh, nine. Nine. What floor are we on? Nine. We're on nine? Yeah. Nine? <laughs> we're going to the top and we're going to work our way Yeah. So I guess we're headed to the elevator unless there's another office over here. I'm wondering what this office is. Go ahead, sorry. What are you up to? Oh, we're taking pictures and video of everybody. Just for the hell of it? Yeah, just for yeah. some Yeah. I just want to take it, but, and then I'm going to disseminate it on social media and show every, like, I have hundreds of thousands of followers, so I'm going to take pictures and video, uh -huh. and then everything I get, I'm just going to dump on the internet. Okay. Thanks. Have a great day. How are you today? Look like such smiling, happy faces. Good to see everyone having a great day at work today. Rock on, okay? This is the Big Smile Show. I am so shocked right now that, like, every Yeah! It's like, it's nuts. Well, we're gonna. We're, I mean, everyone's known we're coming into town. Like, so they had like weeks to prepare. Like what is this office oh. here? Oh. This isn't staff only. Oh, this is the Boston Planning and Development oh, Office. Oh, look at all those really nice shovels. Oh, dude, that is a sick shovel. Oh, look at the the waterfront view. And this, have you ever watched the show Boston Legal? This was often featured in it. As Denny Crane, like, that was supposed to be his office. So if, this is what I think is funny. When they make shows that have your hometown's name in it, they actually film the show there. Yeah. I'm from Tulsa, and they film Tulsa King and OKC. And then now in the show, they're like, well, we're going to film it in Atlanta. Oh, that's not... Hey, listen, the very first episode of Cheers wasn't filmed too far here. Most people think it was at Faneuil Hall. It wasn't as up the street, but you got to go where everyone knows your name, right? Right. <laughs> How are you guys? Can I get yeah. you any? No, no, we're just taking a look around and getting some, some good pictures of everything and video. Excellent. Well, you can't miss our model room. Where is that at? Well, um, so these are all people's off working offices. So, yeah. But if you take a left and go almost to the end, on your left is the big model of the city. Oh, yeah. Ooh. We see oh, yeah. We'd like to see that. Thank oh, you. Okay. That's wonderful. Sick. No, but right below us is the Wait, is the left? At the yeah. very end, she said, almost left. I'm sure one of the employees will put us in the It's a model of the city. It's, they said it's a big model of the city. I'm excited. Big model of the city. Big model of the city. You know what the big model is? I told you. She's big. Go this way, don't they? See, I told him there was a model down here, and he's looking for Tyra Banks. I don't know why. Big model. I remember her name was Candace. See, look. City Tulsa? Never be able to do this. You like to do never let you. Mm-hmm. Well, listen, not not for nothing, but two years ago, you wouldn't have been able to do this here. Oh, wow. Is this it? Yeah, this is sick. This is awesome. Oh, wow. Holy Hannah. Is this a boat move? Like, can you imagine doing your planning meetings and talking and being able to, like... Well, this is so. This is where we are, right over here. That's the Zakum, right there, right, and then uh, that little bridge, and then there's TD Bank Garden. So we're right off to the right of that. Where were we last night? Where's Fenway Park? Fenway should be oh, right there. over there. Yeah, that's Fenway, right? Where? Are no, this is the airport. Yeah, that's definitely the airport. Fenway's. It'd be is, over there. What is this? Right. I here? can't see Fenway. Parking. That's a hotel. It looks like they're Hyatt Regency. They have another model. Bro, that's, I wonder if Tulsa has something like that, or any other city. This is the first time I've ever seen this. This is really cool. See, I can do that. These things are awesome. Where the heck is Fenway? It's got to be. It should be over there somewhere. O M G. That's awesome, isn't it? 
This is all, almost as awesome as those cool, nice guys we saw in the window that like waved at us. This is almost as cool. We're never going to see them again, but I mean, it was, they were nice to me. Oh my God, they're actually right there. They're right behind us. Hey guys, sorry to bother you. I don't see Fenway. I don't see Fenway. Excuse me, sir. Do you know where Fenway is? Is, Fen is Fenway on here? Uh, I, don't I don't mean to bother you. I couldn't see. It should be right over there, right? So they don't have it. Okay. Oh, in the other room. There's another room. No. Thank you. All right. Well, thank you very much. Sorry to bother you. I don't think it's on here anywhere. That's okay. Well, now Boston sucks. I'm going home. Yeah, we got to go home now. This was awesome. That's this like a chunk of Back Bay. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Like, so it should be... Fenway's on that either. No. Yeah. And I was thinking maybe right over there. Maybe they're just redoing it or something. No, it's it's a space thing. You oh, need, okay. You need, like, another, I think, another 30 feet that way. 20 oh. feet that way. Gotcha. Because you see that's the public garden. Yeah, and yeah, yeah. And then the Mall goes, like, half a mile at least. Oh, okay. So it's pretty far out. Yeah. Oh, well, and then that cell station right there, they're pretty, you can tell, pretty good. Cell station, yeah, right here. Yeah. With the tower. Yep. Yeah. Very nice. Well, thanks very much for your help. I appreciate it. Do what? It's, this is an essential role of government right here. I mean, look, it's like the best government Lego set. Except for like, if I'm in the city and I'm planning something, having something like this to be able to sit there and talk about it and think strategically and look at it, it's pretty freaking cool. Well, records request on how much this cost. Oh, yes. Absolutely. How many hours it took to put into it? How much money the people that put it together got paid? Like, this. I just, just, just to see where the money's yeah, at. Yeah, when we find out where we did the records request, yeah. All money spent on the development of the model. All right, I'm playing Name Bingo. There's a couple names in the door. I'm going to see if I can get it. Adam. He's, no, I, was, I wasn't pointing at you, I was pointing at him. He's Adam. No, I was saying Adam is, is like, a, is like a, in science, sometimes atoms and molecules are important. You are Jonathan? Mm -hmm. See, I got it right on my first try. Yeah, good job. Good job. I'm not going to go for another one because that took two strikes. Uh, all right, are we ready? <laughs> yeah, we're ready. All right. <laughs> that was cool. I'm glad we walked down there for this. Otherwise, I feel bad for these people working. In these oh, look at the waterfront view they got here. Look at that, Ron. The waterfront view. Oh, yeah, that is an amazing view from a government office. So that's the Marriott to the right, and that's the old wharf building. Yeah, that view does not suck. No. Nope. Right here. No, yeah. I mean, we all have the same pretty much view, heading in the same direction. I mean, that's... Oh, this is empty, so I'll take a look. Here's an empty one. Here's an empty one. That's Boston, folks. See that um, big terminal far out there? That's um, Logan International. Yeah. That's this thing's bread and butter. Holy shit. Yeah, super cool. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. All right. We'll head to the next floor. Yeah, head to the next floor. All right. Oh, is there a meeting? Are we supposed to be at a meeting? I wasn't invited to the meeting. I don't know. Hang on. Seriously, look at her. You see what she's walking? In those pants, like, or, like... Some people don't, you know, think, like, should I buy this? They just buy it. Oh, this way. Thank you very much. Yes, that was very interesting. Thank you. Everyone's so nice here. I'm like, it's this. It was only a couple of years ago I was here last, and they were. Just I mean, I'm jerks. Ron. I'm telling you, went to every office and every single floor and got content from each one of them. Really? I, oh yeah, it was like a three-hour video, man. It was I. Did, it was crazy. Do we? Long way down, huh? What do we got here? It's a hearing room. This is where people teach. Is there hearing going on? 
No? Oh, boy. It's a very nice room. Nice little room there. Yeah, she really pissed him off at that elevator. What? She pissed him off at that elevator. How, how do you know? Oh, when they, when they got in, when yeah, they said. There's just a look on her face. <laughs> <laughs> so, guys, you didn't see what I did, but uh, half the elevators aren't working. I guess they got mad. No. Racial access and legal justice. Oh, wait, I read it wrong. Language access and racial justice. Oh, it's open. Hey, do you apply uh, to get services here? How do folks reach out to you and start asking for services? Okay. Right. Hi. Hi. I was just wondering, like, how folks get, like, if someone has an issue and they need your help, do they come in and, like, apply for service? Or do you know? Okay. Thank you. Yeah, I didn't know if, like, folks had to apply for it because I didn't even know this office was here and I thought that it was pretty awesome that it is. Yeah. I think that's the first time I've ever seen that. Yeah, no, so we're a language and communications access group. Basically, we work with every department in the city to ensure oh, gotcha. they are acquiring conditions uh, for the students that need it. So, for example, if someone comes to housing and they speak Spanish, Housing is in the like obligation to provide interpreters for them on the coast. Right. So we work with different vendors, different um, people that can do like. Oh, so you kind of like outsource. You like, as a middleman, you put people in contact with the resources that they need. I understand. Okay. Because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I, I I didn't see anything about this office online. I thought I was pretty good at looking up all the offices, and I was like, oh, it's gotta check that one out. Yeah, no, but um, but yeah, we work with departments, and we make sure that they know how to acquire all the services to provide to the city constituents. Beautiful. Well, thanks so much for answering my question. It was, it wasn't well thought because I didn't quite know how to ask it, but you did great. Yeah, Thank you. So Appreciate it. Have a good day. Right, bye. Thank you. Bye, Brittany. Are you Brittany? Is that what, is that your name? No. Sorry, I saw you sitting at the desk. I didn't want to assume. So, what is it? Oh, you're an intern. Got it. Okay. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Oh, nice. Give me permission to be here. Ma'am, would you like to elaborate? What? Ma'am. Nice suit, man. Look at that, huh? Excellent suit. First person in here I see you know how to dress. Good for you, man. Neighborhood services. Okay. Oh, there's all the labor laws. Hey, how's it going? How are you? What company? Huh? You filming? What company? Yeah, no, I'm not from a company. We can not film. Yeah. Yeah, we're just taking a look around and seeing everything that you guys have here, checking out all the services and all the nice people. Yeah, no, that's... Can I, can I have this? Is this for the public? I know, before, before you get filmed, you're supposed to have a little consent, right? A what? Before someone gets filmed. A consent? No, no, you don't need consent. There's no expectation of privacy in public. Yeah, I, I'm hoping so. I'm hoping so. You can eat your food. I'm not going to get you on film while, while you're eating. Do your thing. Person. <laughs> it's a very lively office. I really like the, the atmosphere. 
Yes, I am. Excuse me. She's got such a nice smile, too, very welcoming. Well, thank you. Who are you guys with? Uh, I'm with him, okay. and he's with him. I, I guess, like, we're all together, but not not together, but, like, separately. Are you a media team, or? I wouldn't say we're really a team. Okay. We're more independent, but we do work well as a team. Okay, okay. So I guess. spreading awareness about the... We just, well, we want to see, like... What every office looks like and how nice the people are. Most people, when they come to City Hall, like they don't get to see the whole experience. Oh, they just. I mean, is there something that we can help you guys with specifically? Uh, no, we're just gonna uh, take I'm some sorry. pictures and video. I think he needed some. I'm sorry. What were you gonna say? I didn't want to interrupt you. I think he was just looking to speak to the the supervisor. Overlord? Crime boss. Oh. Um, I think yeah. Me, I, I could have swore she told me I could get an exclusive interview with the crime boss. Oh, thank you. oh, I just saw this gentleman. He was in the other room, right? How are you? Good, yourself? Good, thank you. No so that? nice. I love his attitude. He's just sitting there, relaxing, smiling on his face. He's like, I don't... <laughs> I'm sorry? No, I appreciate you asking. I do mind. Yeah, I'll put it away. Oh, perfect. Yeah, you're getting me the boss, though. Right? Here, I'll, I'll put this one away. Oh, he, he paused it. Yeah, he's good. Oops, I stopped it. Oh. I meant to pause it. I stopped it, though. It stopped. Yeah, it stopped. <sighs> what? Okay. Oh, sorry, my friend. Pull back off. Pull back off. Okay. Well, I'll, I'll let you do your thing. No, no, no. You can stay. We're going to do an exclusive interview, I think. Oh, okay. Okay, sure. Hey, the permitting office down the hall could be fun, because it's like... That's exactly... I do need to visit the blonde, short, blonde-haired lady. Yeah. The well, there's business permit. Yeah. Just running around with some... Uh, yeah, no, take your time. We can... What, yeah, sure, sure, sure. What's your, what's my your friend name? Carlos will stay here, and then we'll come back. She's giving me an exclusive interview with the crime boss. She's going to get him right now. So we're going to go down this way? Uh, yeah, he's going to have his interview. This guy, I already told him, his suit is on point. He must do that every day. He walks in here with the best suit in the building. That's exactly what he's up to. Why well, do I don't have more strip clubs? But the permit thing is there in this office down here. Well, I think uh, James should get... We should wait to go in there until James comes so he can read the Google review after you, sir. And then he can say, I'm looking for so-and-so, and they're going to say who. And then he's going to say, bomb, 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 bomb. Get on the water. It was, wait a minute, which way was it? It was this way. <laughs> oh look, it, what is a mayor's office of food justice? Like what I don't is know, that? Equity and food yeah, distribution? Check out the food in here. Is it good? Uh, it actually doesn't I already smell had, bad. I had that diner though earlier. Really yeah. Great. I'm all breakfast stuff. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, it was down here. What's that office? That looks like a back yeah. entrance. <laughs> so James is meeting with the crime boss. He has an exclusive interview with the boss of crime. Yeah. Are they really getting the person to Equity see? and inclusion. Hi guys. Oh, Hi. Hello, sir. How are you? First Amendment auditors? No. No? Uh, no, they, we just got some complaints about uh, you, uh, Officer Silta. And so me? We were just, yeah. Yeah, we got some complaints about you. So we got sent over here by Internal Affairs to investigate you for uh, the complaints. They said that you've been harassing people in the equity and inclusion offices at the city of uh, Boston. So. I doubt that. No, seriously, we got a complaint about it. I doubt it. A citizen, no, an internal a citizen, citizen's yeah. complaint yeah. So was, was sent. About uh, Officer Silta and the complaints. I mean, the, the Equity Inclusion Office, they've been complaining about you. Okay. I don't know. Can you tell me a little bit more? I mean, they just think you're kind of annoying and that they don't like the um, governmental authorities being over here. Well, I, I can tell you that I'm, I'm welcomed here all the time. Really? So that's if, cool. if that's it, then we're done. I'm not done. I'm just standing here. Okay. Are you, are you done? I'm done. I'm you're, done. You're, you've got feet right there. They're, they're yeah. free to walk away. You kind of yeah. like to. You walk up to me. No, I just came over to ask if you guys were First Amendment auditors because you have the phones and you have a recording device, which is fine. 
Okay, okay you're allowed to do I'm that. Glad, I'm glad it's fine with you, Officer yeah, Sultan. Yeah, we're, we're, I'm glad it's okay we're, we're with fine. Officer Sultan. That's, yeah, that's we're, good. We're I really with. care. When I woke up this morning, I said, you know what I said to myself? I called my wife. She's back in Oklahoma, and I said, you know, I'm really concerned about whether Officer Silta is going to let me record in this government building today or not. Okay. I mean, she was concerned Sarcasm about Sarcasm is a lost art. Yeah, I don't know. What, about, what is this First yeah. Amendment audit thing? Yeah, what is that? Okay, that's very close to what it is that you're doing. When people come in with cameras... Documentary and, stuff? Yeah, making a documentary, whatever you want to interpret it as. In a public building, we're, we're used to it. And what we want to do as well is protect your. What is their general right? purpose? We like we're we're doing a documentary, but like what is their general purpose? I've never heard of this. Everybody's thing. got a different uh, purpose for First Amendment auditing. What like is what, what is the general no. consensus? No, no. I've never. Are they a problem for you? Or, no. Or, no they're, okay. No. Well, that's cool. I gotta look. So, I gotta, gotta. Is it on uh, seen, Facebook have, or something? Have, do you go around this building often? I'm in charge of the building for security. the whole building. Yeah. Well, that's, have you been up on the ninth floor and seen the? Uh, Whole model of uh, of Boston. Okay, I'm, I'm not going to answer that question. I'm just here to make sure that you're right. You're not going to answer that question of whether you've seen the model. Sure. We just got done looking at the model on the ninth floor. You've not seen the model of Boston on the ninth floor. No, I'm not going to answer any further questions. I'll monitor you folks. Well, why why gonna are you going to not answer any further questions? I, I, this is a serious question. Are you we disinclined to acquiesce to our query? Uh, the ninth floor, and they have this big model of the city of Boston. And I'm just inquiring as to whether you've seen it. It's impressive. If you've not seen it, you should go up to planning and development, and they'll show you where it's at. It's absolutely impressive, although it's like they need 30 more feet. We just got a tour of it. It was really cool. Mm. you not seen it? Oh, I'm not going to answer it. He's disinclined to acquiesce well, to our why queries. Are still, why are you still here talking to me then? You can walk away. I don't need your services. I, I don't care. Okay, I'm, I'm just going to monitor, make sure that you're so first. You're going to follow me right. and annoy yeah. me. Oh, I'm not going to annoy you. you. I'm you're going to follow me. This is a public building. Yeah, but see, here's the thing about that, officer. Yeah. What I believe that you're doing in following me is that you are intentionally trying to make it uncomfortable for somebody to exercise their First Amendment rights to engage in a constitutional like prior restraint. Activity. I think and we're said. in the fir we're in the First Circuit Court of Federal Appeals. Mm -hmm. And there's been clear case law on the right of people to film in public places and to not be harassed, harangued, or otherwise intimidated uh, by officers uh, in the performance of their duties that are inhibiting or in any other way interfering with our abilities to do this without any kind of fear of reprisal, repercussion, or anything else. Okay. You following me makes me very uncomfortable. And I think there's also a statute in the city of Boston, as well as the state of Massachusetts, uh, that deals with people who feel uncomfortable when somebody's following them. I think it's called stalking. Annoying and accosting. Right, annoying and accosting and harassing me. So what you're yeah. doing right now is causing me to feel alarmed, threatened, and harassed. And okay. I believe those are the specific words of the Massachusetts statute. I looked it up before I came here. Okay. Well, um, that's your I, opinion. But no, it's not my opinion. I went to law school. Where'd you go? Are you an attorney? I am. Can I see a BDO card? No. Then you're not an attorney here. Then I'm not an attorney. Oh, yeah. I'm not an attorney. Un unless you, unless really? you want, unless you want <laughs> So I, I didn't go to law school? I didn't go to law school? I didn't graduate from that. I didn't graduate from law school. I don't I don't have a I don't have a license to practice in lots of courts all across the country. Are you are you are you representing an yourself? I'm what? asking you to stop following me. Well I'm not gonna do that. Oh you're not gonna hey that's great. Yeah. You're you're just giving me fantastic comment to make yourself right. officer still to look like a bag. That's what okay. you're doing. Fine. So if you wanna look like a bag, you can follow me around. I'm gonna and there's really not a lot of Boston strip clubs, except for men's strip clubs. Is that where y'all are going? Is that where all the officers are going? They're going to the men's I saw a lot of those review clubs for men's clubs. Are y'all going to spend a lot of time there? I'm not going to answer that question. No. Oh, so that's a, that's a yes. No. He doesn't. No, he doesn't not. recall. Does your husband? Does your husband allow you to go there and do that kind of stuff, or is that kind of like cheating? Uh, I'm not going to answer the question. No. I mean, no. does he? So, so y'all don't talk about it. Is, is it, else, is but... it uh, don't talk, don't tell? Are we are we operating that military policy of where we just don't talk about these kind of things? So as long as you know your husband's okay with it, you can go to the club and get bent over as many times as you want to. Or how's that working? I'm not going to answer that question. No, why not? I mean, your husband was talking to us about it last night. No, you can ask all these questions you want and run your batteries down. Oh, I got plenty of batteries. This, I thing, will go, this thing will go forever. Hey, when I, you're done, I got the 4K cinema cameras. When you're done with your three batteries, I got like four more. Yeah, so we should be good for got, at least 36 hey, hours. I got, I got this Straight thing too. Going. I got another well, I get paid to be here all day. I, so I get paid too. Two. I get paid by the hour. I get, I'm glad I get paid a little bit higher out of the rate per hour than you do. I don't care. No, I don't either. No. I mean, we can do this all day. You Me too. Look really good. Thank you. You're gonna make you're gonna make a great. Um, uh, what do they call those things? I believe they call it a thumbnail. Thumbnails. That's what they call. Them. I don't use those. That's what they call them. So I'm again, back to the back to the videographer mail clubs. Are they, are they fun to go to? Do you know the answer to that, or was that not in your uh, sergeant's?
Well, the answer is what it's three up and three down. It's called the end of the inning, you idiot. It's called baseball. That's Robin Williams. Come on now. He's going to harass us, Abrams. That's what he's going to do. So consumer affairs and entertainment. Oh, what's over here? I missed this one. See, now his plan doesn't quite work because there's two of us and one of him, so we can't harass everybody. I guess Ron is. Oh, that way. I am the supervisor. I'm at. I'm at. Somebody, so you're it. So you don't report to somebody? Who's Maybe you could file a complaint with him against him and he can investigate himself. So where do I go file a complaint against you? Is he interrupting you? Then you need to leave now. You need to leave this office because she's helping a, a resident and you're interrupting. And if you're going to interrupt, then we can restrict you by time, place, and manner. So you're okay. right. They, they're free to continue their engagement. No, she, no, she works here, and she's asking you to leave. She's okay. not asking you to leave. She, 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 she has to hold take it down outside. the conversation. Right. She could not be engaging in public activity right in the lobby. That, that'd be a common sense thing to do. So you're loud and you're disturbing. This is a place of business, sir. So if you're disturbed. You're the one causing the disturbance. No, you're no. harassing us, causing the disturbance. Okay. You can't cause the disturbance. So you're, you're, you're disturbing, you're disturbing you this office. You can't cause the yeah. disturbance. You're, you're disturbing this office here. This is a place you're of business. You're causing the disturbance okay. by engaging in an interaction with us. You if you would mind? leave me alone. No, no. I did just six. Okay, good. If good. you would leave us alone. every button alone. on the elevator, okay. too. That is what you classy. I didn't cost anybody on the elevator. No, you pressed every single button. On the I didn't press any buttons on an elevator. Thank you. <laughs> Wait, what? I'm not going to answer your questions. I'm just informing you. If you want to listen to me or not, that's fine. Okay. All right. Now I'm going to go in here and do some business. Thanks. Okay. Just so you know, this this guy here is a First Amendment honor. There's a lot to come in and video Hey, my friend. I'll go ahead. You're good. You were interrupting what I'm trying to do. Have I tried to walk past I'm not there interrupting and do you. anything? I'm not interrupting you. I'm just informing you. How can I help you? You can get this guy to shut up for a second. He doesn't seem to understand, like, you know, common decency. Real easy thing. Let me answer this real quick. We're over here in permitting. We're over in permitting on 80, in 809. 809. So, is this the Oh, man, that stinks, huh? That stinks. Don't don't erase that, man. I'm gonna do a records request for it, okay? Notice a cease and desist for the destruction of that video or photographic evidence, because it now is pertained to a FOIA request. I mean, unless I can give you my email address, Sarge. If you want to just email it to me, you can just send it over. Uh, I, I googled strip clubs in Boston, and there's not a lot of them, so I was just curious as to what the requirements are. That must be fairly difficult. I'm not even sure. I don't know why the sergeant's being mean to me. I haven't said two words to him. I mean, literally, I don't think I've said one word directly to him. But he's seeming to want to be taking my picture and... I'm going to do a governmental open records act request for your, for the video that you're taking. Oh, I can see his inbox. It's my first amendment, right? It's my first I think he's just mad at the other guy, so he's like giving me an attitude, like, because I'm with him. I think that's the issue today. I don't know. It just seems he's like. First of all, oh, okay. She's not got a very good attitude. It's and she's creating a government record, so just don't want her to delete that because that would be a violation of the first amendment. I just let her know that she's preserved that. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 Okay.
Sure. First of all, you need to be in the adult entertainment district, which is about a two-block radius. That's what, okay, so that's perfect. That's what, that, that always my question. So the two-block area, where's that area at? It's, well, that, I don't know what's going on. This officer thinks, like, Ron's not nice. So then he started taking pictures of me, but I haven't even spoken to this police officer. He called me uh, a First Amendment auditor thing. He wouldn't elaborate on what a First Amendment auditor does, but he said that I was one of those things. So, like, the gentleman, what do you do if, like, there's, like, the gentleman that was just in here that was needing some help and she was, she was taken care of, yeah. uh, and then... So Have you heard of that? A First Amendment auditor? I'm a camera guy. I paid $250 an hour just to film whatever I'm told to film. Yeah, I don't understand what this... I can give you my card if you want to hire my services. Yeah, I don't understand what this First Amendment audit thing... I don't know why the cops don't start hiring me to follow you guys around. He, he took my picture, which is fine. I'm, I'm just going to... I'm going to use his picture of me... To add into this video. Hello, municipal. Oh, you guys have um special police powers, right? What is the there? There's a security. So a long time ago, there was like Metro Boston PD, and it was defunct in like the late seventies, and then they were they. They turn into like the a city security force, but they maintained police powers or something. I was reading up on all like the different police departments and agencies that used to exist. Do you know what that one is? So you guys are just like the security for the building here. Gotcha. gotcha. Uh, this this um, sergeant here said that he believes we're something called a First Amendment auditor, and I've never heard of this. Do you know what that is? I'm gonna. Okay, I'll, I'll I'll do that because I've never heard of this First Amendment audit thing. What is a First Amendment auditor? That's what it's called, right? First Amendment audits uh, usually involve photographing or filming from a public space. Why is that like First Amendment, not just like photography? There must be a specific reason as to why they consider it um, activism, citizen journalism, uh, film and photograph government buildings. Is it because we're filming in a government building that he believes we're First Amendment auditors? Yeah, I'm just a documentarian. I think it's this. That's all right. Yeah, no, no worries. I just want to know how they have that big badass model with those families. I know, I got it on here so I can go back I'm going to post mine on YouTube too. Just like you. I'll bet. So you are? You are? You are? And you. That's good. So he's got he's got about 600,000 followers, so I'm betting his video is going to be a little bit better picked up than yours. We really care about that. Thank you. You should. Do you have any questions? I mean, you should. She's not. It's not going to reflect well. Okay. This office and her behavior, it's not going to reflect well. Just like his behavior is not going to reflect well on the Boston Police Department. Um, no, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Sergeant, I looked up what a First Amendment auditor is, and I mean, that is clearly not myself, so. <sighs> I was just trying to introduce myself. I was just trying to, I, I, it looked like you were having a difficult time with him. No, you're going to post a video on social media. I'm not interested in shaking hands with you. I don't believe that you're here for the best intentions. No, like, we have work to do. Is there, is, what, what is, we, we're a busy office. It's a Monday morning, Monday afternoon now. We have work to do. Is there anything else we can help you with, James and company? I was trying to just leave this over there and just be polite. Okay, thank you. I appreciate that. What's your name, though? Again, it's Alyssa. Can you turn the camera off? I, I sent it over there to try to make you more comfortable. Okay. And you're just nasty. Are, are you are you folks considering them disrupting business yes, here at the office? Yes, they're disrupting business. Okay, then that's I'm gonna. That's not the way it works. Alyssa, Alyssa to Tobin. Yeah, that's me. Her name yeah, is Alyssa like Tobin. Yes, sir. What's your name? I'm Sergeant Silta. I'm in charge of the building. 
Okay. You're in charge of the building? I'm in charge of the building. I'm James. Okay. I'm in charge of my building. She's okay. giving me a public records request. Shut I'm, your I'm mouth and walk out. Public records request don't happen in this yeah, office. I'm just going to send him the emails. Hey, John, can you help me out with yeah. I'm, I'm not from Massachusetts. What's that? I, I can't do a written records request here in this office. You can. You can turn in a written records request in any and office. And I can do it on any piece of paper now? Absolutely. You don't need an official I, I form. It all gets processed through the sixth floor of the law department. So I'm just. If you file yeah, it here, we still have to give it. That's, that's fine. Right, you're gonna. Uh, no, yeah. So they'll, there's, they'll pass it on, but you can take and file it. But they're here. required no, to have a record clerk process. in every okay. department. They're required to have a record clerk to receive records requests in every can department. I'll show you where that is. You want to see it? No, it's every department every has department. to have it. Okay. You get? You stupid. You don't get out. You've already been told once before. Your mouth needs to stop. Walk out the door. Um, I'm not going anywhere. Okay. Well, quit running your mouth. I'll be starring in your video the entire time. Okay. We, we appreciate that. It so, makes for good content. Uh, all I need to do is a records request for her footage because I need to post it on my social media. You might want his also. He took a he took he video took a footage video as well, yeah. That's all I need. No, I didn't take any video. Oh, pick, it could have been a picture. No, nope, didn't do that. I, I, Audio. I got it recorded. I, I mean, unless you deleted it, I saw you recording it. I just held my phone up. Well, I want to do a no problem right with that. It was recording, man. No, it wasn't recording. Yes, it was, dude. We'll find out. I'll, I'll, I'll get an open record request for that, and then we'll dump the phone. I'll subpoena it. See, this is this is what I mean. Like, she's in charge of security of the building, and she's being. But you're being. What my point is, you're being very professional. You haven't been mean or rude, and in turn, because you haven't been mean or rude, have any of us been mean or rude to you? Because respect was given, and then respect was earned, right? So you treated us with respect, and then we treated you with what? Respect. So the reason he's, the, the reason we're telling him he's a piece of shit is probably because he didn't give respect. No, and he, didn't, he couldn't even answer. He couldn't even answer a question about whether he saw a diagram. Or yeah, he doesn't want. He, no, we're not answering the dialogue. We don't have. Yeah, because she was she was being professional, and you don't want her to cross the blue line. You just said that's the problem with cops and people in the in, in the in the position that you're in. You just said it right there. We don't have to. Why not just do it out of common decency? I was trying to have a conversation with you about whether you saw something that I thought was really cool upstairs, and you couldn't even acknowledge whether it existed because you wanted to be a pain in the neck and you didn't want to be cooperative and be assisting to. Just the eye rolls and stuff that you're doing. You give yourself away. You look like a schmuck. Well, that's I mean, you absolutely. I know it's my opinion, and, it, and it's the truth. See, my opinion is usually right. And I think we're we're emerging on like fact like now. We're we're past opinion. We're on fact. How yeah, many people I mean, are going to see how you're behaving? Well. We're we're well past well opinion. Yeah, we're well past opinion. Yeah. But again, thank you for being so professional and and. Um, she says he's the highest ranking person in the building. I said, dear God, Lord, help us all. Yeah, I mean, well, I mean, I was, I was going to say, you know, it doesn't take a lot to, to wear a Boston police uniform. She should be wearing a Boston police uniform. Very professional, very kind. Sorry? Yeah, then, so, so we were just getting interior shots of the offices uh, to match him with some B-roll from outside. Checking out the State House, Faneuil Hall, all the big buildings, uh, Wharf, Old Marriott. Um, so we were going by, and he said that we're these First Amendment audit people. And I've never heard of this before. right? I do documentary work. I take nice pictures and video. But I've never heard. And then he said I was a First Amendment auditor. And I never even looked it up until I, I was right in front of you. You were there when I looked it up. So I just don't like... You know, people telling me I am or I'm not something. I'm I'm here being polite and respectful. I'm not giving anybody a hard time. And all I would like in return is for to, to get the same. You know what I mean? So I'm a little bit confused as to why he is so unhinged. I hope he doesn't go home and beat his wife with that attitude. What office is this? Licensing and consumer Hey, Josh, can you help me out with this? Sure. What do you need help with? Making sure that I meet all the standards for open records requests in your state. Um, <clears throat> name on the top, uh, sorry, date on the top, listed as an official records request, just write records request on the top. Okay. And then um, as long as you're specific with what you're asking for, just provide an email and write good citizen. 
Right? Is that fair? Yeah, it is. It is. That that is. By four people with cameras. You know, yeah, I'll like, tell you this though. I own the business for about 20 years, and I always had the government popping in on me unannounced to check up on me. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And so I, I kind of feel like turned by the fair play, right? And he, and, and in all it's, fairness, he was also um, dealing with a, a jerk with a camera, Alyssa. So I mean, it's it's usually like you know, we're, I've I've said nothing disrespectful until people have been disrespected to disrespected to me. I, did I come into this office and speak to any single one of you? In fact, I stood right outside the door and I was quiet. I didn't interrupt anybody and I just observed. It's that tall line. And you still, like, started filming me. And I think he's looking for her cell phone footage, uh, any video or photo so that she was taking. How do we get your cell phone? You wait until you see it hit a million views on YouTube after just a couple hours. The difference is, is that you work for the public sector. We don't. So anything that you do is part of your official official duties. Create a public record. I'll be calm, man. She's nice. She's yeah, that's right. I'm sorry. You're, you are nice. Are you all set with that yet? I, I'm sorry. I'm, I am no problem. pretty Cause, slow. Just because once I get that, then I can scan it in and okay. actually do something with it. Okay. Uh, so the date and then official records request. Okay, just write records request on the top. And then make sure they uh, they stamp it for you so it doesn't get lost. I'm a little slow in there. Not a problem. Yeah, we're yeah, we'll good. We don't need any more paperwork. Um, during, yeah, I would write, um, in the course of her official duties, creating a public record. Because you don't want them to respond back to you and say that they're not, they don't have access to those because it's in her personal cell. So you have to be very descriptive that she created a public record. All growing pains I went through before. In the course of her official duties. In the course of her official duties, creating a public record. Because then they'll just say that, that it's, they don't have, under mass law, they don't have access to those records. But now she's on notice, and if she deletes it, then, I mean, then you get to, to sue her for destruction of, well, it's, 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 a, it's, a, it's a felony. It's a felony for her to delete the records, yeah. But you can also sue her civilly, and then you can sue the Licensing and Consumer Affairs Office for the negligent supervision of Alyssa Tobin. So you get them on the state side and the federal side. Okay. Well, I don't mind giving my information too. So normally people give no, their information. No, no, no. You don't give. You just give. Uh, we need your contact information. Right. So an, email, an email address. Yeah. Just do an email address and whatever name they want you to call you. Like you can say. Um, I'm not anonymous. I'm. You, you, your name could be, you know, whatever. Just be creative. Be whoever you want. You can. You can. Your name can be Mr. Tobin. I mean, my phone number and everything is posted publicly, so... Yeah. Well, if it's possible that we get an official, like, some type of first name, last name, so that we do make sure to reach the right person. Now, if you send it to the email, they'll, it'll get right where it needs to go. And then they'll oh, take nine yeah, days I'm and... i my name, email, and a phone oh, number. Oh, see, that's good. Look at him. He's agreeable. Right. He's giving away. He's that's making it easier. Uh, yeah. Yep. That way we know actually where to send the public record. Beautiful. See, we actually turned out to be reasonable people, right? Sure, yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Are you from Saugus or Revia? That's that's not public information where I'm from. Well, do, I mean, I mean, I, I can just, I don't think you're from Dorchester. I think you have you have like a little bit of Revia, maybe a Lynn flair to you. Whatever you, whatever. You know, like that super, that Josh, super passive aggressive. Uh, yeah, I don't mind you. That was received. Sure. I just got this is open records request for the cell phone footage from Melissa's phone that she took in the license exclusion in the course of her official duties, creating a public record. Yeah, it looks good. That looks good. And you're going to stamp it as received, and then yep. I'll scan it in to uh, our email and public records. All right. Oh, no, so, I'm going to scan it in. So we're accepting service of it, so nine, day, nine business days from ten. today, right? Ten, ten excuse me. All right. Hey, I appreciate you, sir. Thanks. Thank you, sir. Have a wonderful rest of your day. For not treating us like shit like Alyssa. Thank you. What's your name, ma'am? Uh, Sergeant Kirk. Sergeant what? Thank you for being very nice. Yeah, she's awesome. Good for you. Do you um, have you ever uh, considered joining the police force? Debatable. Licensing. Over here, the security guard. She's very nice, very professional. Wonderful to see that. Are you a supervisor here? No. No? Wonderful. So. She's. She's awesome.
very, very nice. Some, some Boston cop came up to us, giving us a hard time because of the camera, and she was like, fine. She was, she was very, very nice. You know? but, so you guys are doing a great job. I just wanted to tell you. I feel like if a compliment is due to anybody, you compliment them. Oop. I mean, it's a public building, ma'am. So now you're on it. That almost like tripped me to tell me she didn't want to be on a camera. That was so weird. I gave you a compliment and then some Karen freaked out at me for having a camera. Who? Me? She gave you a, uh, where, where are we going, Josh? Um, we're going to go um, around. You want to follow me? You haven't even given me your number. You haven't even given me your number. Equity inclusion. Are we going to lunch? I don't know. I have to find the rest of our people that we've known from time to time, but don't always know. She said she flipped out when Ron went in there. Um, she's like, yeah, they're a bunch of jerks. And she said to the cop, and this guy points to Ron, hit every button in the elevator on the way down. Oh, that was you. I didn't know such thing. But I mean, I just thought it was interesting that I was being blamed. Oh, they allow, we can, we can smoke out here? Smoke weed only. Oh, that's cool. I, I just didn't, I didn't know because I saw the door open with a little smoker's pole. It's a, oh, cool, for smoking, wow. Um, maybe we'll just go to seven. That's where, I think that's more. So there's an elevator. Which way do we go to go to the elevator? I say we go down the stairs. The elevator, oh, you want to go down the stairs? We race. Okay. Oh, we'll just go down these stairs, yeah. Okay. We just want to go down to the next floor. Is that like, going to bring us there? Main elevator is going to be this way. Oh. Yeah, main stairs. Main stairs this way. Okay, thank you. So confused right now. <laughs> An elevator right here. Let's go. Hello. How are you? Good. How are you today? You just ditched your brother. I can still at my old age. Oh, I'll catch this elevator. Don't close. Oh, I made it just in time. Oh, that was fucking awesome. <laughs> oh, man. No. <laughs> Shit. Can you imagine her turning around being like, oh, they got me. We're magicians. Where they got me. Hello. Hi. How are you? Good, yourself? Good, thanks. Hello. Hi. Took my mace at Fenway yesterday. They did, I know. But you could have coat checked it. I'm yeah. assuming they didn't let you coat check it. I didn't even ask. Ooh, engineering. I always love, like, engineering maps. Hello. Hi. Hey, how are you? Good. All right. I really love this office. Oh, hold on a second. Who are you with? Huh? Who are you with? He's oh, with I'm him. with him. Yeah, but I know you're not explaining who you are. I'm me. And you're he's... Certain. Yeah, I'm with him. He's with me. I am me. He is him. And we're together. Here with you today. Did I explain it? Yeah, it's pretty clear to me. Okay. Sorry, I'm not really good with talking to people. I'm usually just the guy taking I, I pictures. Just asking, like, what company are you with? Uh, no one. No one? No. Okay. I mean, I'm from, my, I'm from my house. That's about it. Oh. Yeah. His mother's a very sweet woman. Yeah, she's a very nice lady. Oh, where do you live? Uh, my home. She, I, I, there's she, nothing wrong with her. She's, she's, 
She makes an excellent uh, point. How are you today, sir? Um, I was thank you for asking. I wanted to know if you guys had anything to do with the building of the super cool model on the ninth floor. Like Joel, this building? Yeah, like there's a big model, a scale model of Boston on the ninth floor, and I was wondering if you guys had anything to do with building it. That's the DPDF. The what is it? DPDF. Okay. All right. Okay. It's it's pretty cool. Have you seen it? Awesome. No Fenway though. Seventh floor at City Hall. Right, what, what office? Engineering. Engineering. Oh my god. Uh, like Mary Poppins over here. Some sort of here. We can help you up there. Just I'm getting cool. some B roll here. Just look okay. I'm just his cameraman. Look, okay, I have a big cord and a big stick. Oh, I, I think we lost him. I you. don't think we're in the right office. I, I, well, I can uh, check my phone. Permitting. I don't know where our... Permitting. Do you know what permitting is? Uh, I'm not 100% sure, but this is all one big loop, so we're going to go one direction. We're good. Well, we'll just keep going until we find our, our, our friends. I just bought him the other day, and he's, mm -hmm. like, wandered off already. I should have put GPS on him. No, that's fair. Uh, I think that it might be... If you go down this way towards the... Ocean, it's okay. There's a good sign that has, like, everything okay. on it. Oh. With everything that's on the screen. Okay. All right, yeah, we'll check that out. Yeah, yeah. You Thank just you. Just follow here to the right. Ooh, the environment department. Ooh, I like this office. Oh. I mean, if the government's ordering me to do it. Huh. We're only. We uh, I'm gonna check this one out. Innovation and technology. Ooh, what a sweet office. Oh, look at that view. Lucky folks working in a place with that kind of view. Yeah. Let's, I think I just told them to meet us on uh, six right. because they're in the. Make sure that the blonde that we're looking for in permitting is on this floor. I don't want to miss her. Oh, they I feel like. Do you know where they're at right now? Wasn't that the office we were just in? No, they're on the first floor. There's permitting on the seventh and the second floor. Okay, well let's go look at this. Do you know where the permitting office is? Okay, thanks. You look like you know you got a suit on, so I figure maybe right now. I'll ask over here. Do you know where the permitting office is? Yes. There we go. Room 719. 719. So is that this way? It is, to yes. the right. Okay. Oops. Thank you. <laughs> We're looking for the blonde. That's a mean lady. Oh, they're crushing every floor. Where are they at? Um... On first. They're on first? Yeah. Did they get on the others? I guess. Like, do we just. I don't know. Is it public works permits? Public works permits, contracts permits. It must be here. It must be this one. Let's see. Is this the only permits office here? In City Hall? Well, like if you need a parking 
Planning firm or something? That's a separate office. Which which office was it you supposed see. to be? Sorry, are you filming? Huh? Are you filming? Yeah, video recording. Why? Um, well, I don't really feel like disclosing that. I'm uh, okay. I'm working on. All right, let's turn around. Well, I'm done. Okay. I, I need your help with. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna get you somewhere right now. You said regarding my apartment. Yeah. Okay. Well, and I need to speak with someone specifically. I'll be right back. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> What's that? I mean, this isn't probably a great place to work if you don't want to be on film. I think True. I've seen a hundred cameras already. Yeah. yeah. City permits. So there's multiple offices that do permits. I mean, depending on what type of permit you want. City yeah, permits. You know, the information that I was given, quite frankly, is vague. a little vague. So I'm trying to fill in the blanks. Okay. Yeah. I don't. I think I may be in the wrong office because I believe I was looking for a short, blonde-haired lady. Doesn't look like you. Yeah. Okay. So. Oh, the training. It just started now. Huh? And we got here no. with cameras. They've actually been here for twelve forty-five. Okay. Nice. What are they training on today? New system. New, new computer system or what? Yeah, no driveway system. Oh, all right. Yeah. Hey, how's it going? Um, so, honestly, the information that I was given is a little vague, and I don't even know for sure if I'm in the right permitting office, because I was only told that to go to the per city permits, and, and there's at least two or three offices that do so different types of permits. So, there's different permits? Is it for street permits, sidewalk permit, that's, permits? Uh, that's the problem. They didn't give me that information. Uh, yeah. I'm looking for a blonde-haired lady who wears a mask, who works in city hall permits, who is the rudest person you've ever dealt with. That's the only description I have. Was there anything else? There was a mask. Uh, there's, yeah. Was there anything else in the description that could be helpful? There was, but I well, didn't want to, I mean, it's not my words. Well, what does it say? No. Bitch. Oh. It's, I mean, it's not my... Where are you pulling that description from? Uh, Google. Here. From Google? Google reviews. From okay. recent or years it's, past? It was six months ago. Could it be... I, I don't know. No, yeah. See, this is tough. So this is the tough part. Once I said that, you don't want to explain because you're like, oh, I do know a short no. blonde. Everybody wears a mask. Who's a bitch? I honestly don't. No, so it might. That's a problem. Like there's several parking, permit, parking, permit offices. Par parking or moving. Well, there's a permit oh. office right around. No, so there's the BTD permitting office is where we normally start our permits. And okay. Then come here. We do the street and um, occupancy permits, but then downstairs is the moving the permits. moving permits yeah. division, also through BTD. But I'm not sure who I'm not sure who. What's they moving work. permits? Like uh, you moving into a neighborhood. Student you moving. Move, student moving. Kids moving and out. Right. You have to get a permit to move. Well, you're moving truck. Well, it's because so there's there's no uh, space to even uh, drive down the streets, yeah. let alone. I'm from a big city. This is my guy. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> That's yeah. where, where I come from, we were on a train car in the subway yesterday. There's more people in that car than live in my entire town. What town is it? Uh, Estancia, New Mexico. Oh, wow. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah. Number one. Did you go to school? Number one in the Nate Powell. Oh, God, no. no. Uh, <laughs> I went to school at Google. Oh, all right. Yes. Uh, yeah, I don't know if you know, New Mexico, you, you would think Alabama is number one in the nation for inbreeding, right? No, it's New Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> Google well, it. Well, I don't worry about that. Google it. I don't mind. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you know why they... Uh, well, I, I think we'd say... Affirm, there's no one in this this particular office. Do you know anyone that works at City Hall that fits that description, description specifically the B word? You're probably like, oh, there's about eight of them. Uh, I, I, I do not. See, good, good, good man. He answered our question without saying a word, and I thank I you. Do not. <laughs> yeah, no, honestly, for permitting, it's here with us. You have us here. Um, we don't wear masks. We no longer wear masks. Yeah. Were, was anybody doing that six months ago here? No. Okay. So it would, it would have been abnormal six months ago, yeah. whoever this nasty person is. They, they Alleged say, nasty person. And they didn't say what division, though. No. Just said, like, permit. It was extremely rude for asking clarifying questions. Long. Yeah. Yeah. Well, no one here that fits that description. All right. Well, I'll head back that to New Mexico. <laughs> My sister's waiting Unless for you me. Can, you can go down to the second floor of the mezzanine and go to their permit office. Yeah, that's where yeah. I was going to head next. Yeah. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Oh, so it's called moving permits. Moving permits. Yeah. Thank Thanks. you. Uh, that's probably the one anyway. That's probably the one. 
what is that thing's name? The administrative branch, public improvement commission, highway division, recycling. Do we want to go in here? No. I don't know. Is this some place you want to go inside? Is she just gonna look and then walk away? Why do you look other way? <sighs> Elevators. She was so... Really yeah, I Facebooked her last name and found her. How'd you get your last name? Because it was on her business card. Business card. <laughs> oh. Hi, Yudusky. I'm Dugan Good, thanks. Are they making this up here? I don't know. Are they done or what? I don't know. I guess I should call them and ask, huh? I'll call them. Okay. Call Josh. Maybe Human Resources knows where the lady is. It's a bitch. Oh, dude, yeah. Okay. Go to my HR. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you guys done already? Oh, okay. Are you, are you done? Tell them we're still getting content. Right, cool. You guys are down in here then? All right. I, I'm just going to hit. All right. I'm going to hit HR and then one other place on the and side. And we got to get the mayor's office. All right, man. Bye. We need to get the mayor's office. Hey, Josh, tell them dirty jokes. No. Huh? Tell them dirty jokes. I don't know one off the top of my Hello. How are you? Good, how are you? Um, I just wanted to talk to you about Alyssa Tobin. Um, she's recording? in the. I'm sorry? Are you recording? Oh, yeah. No, you can't record. I can't. Record? Is that, is that like a law or something? Oh, but. What? I think oh. we need to go to the second floor. Maybe. Uh, see if we can find the people in permitting and then get that okay. out of here because they're waiting to. Okay, yeah. They're waiting to move on to the next okay, place. Okay, let's, uh, let's do that. Where's the Schmellishmater? Yeah, the Schmellishmater is this way? They're, they're always in a hurry, man. You gotta, yeah, you gotta, gotta, you gotta move. I guess so. I used to so resent this so much because it was like my birthday time. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, oh, we're gonna do a... What, is this you guys? Oh. Oh, not, not yet. No, wrong floor. Right, quick, let's leave them here, guys. Let's run the floor. I was gonna band together with these fine gentlemen and kick you out of the elevator. You kick me out? Yeah. <laughs> we don't like you. We talked about it. We decided that we think you're a real jerk. Did so. a democratic vote? Yeah. Vote oh. confidence. Yeah. That's the democratic way. Third floor. Going me, down. Me, my One friend, time. my friends and I just don't appreciate you. One time, me and my buddy. That's the third floor. floor. Wrong floor. I guess we'll get off here. Have an excellent day. Uh, no, we gotta go back. We're going to the second floor. Sorry, oh. sir. Wrong floor. I tried to tell him it was the wrong floor. Oh, two pretty, oh, perfect two. Thank you. Everyone's got a nice suit. I mean, jeez. What's going on? It's like, I feel like I'm underdressed. And it's like every person, like everyone usually has the sleppy suits that like is, everyone's got a custom fit. Got your shoes shined. Thank you, thank you. Look at that man. Thank you, guys. Good job. All right. They're on two? <laughs> cargo pants. <laughs> Are we supposed to go this way? Uh, All right, perfect, floor. excellent, and thank you, sir. Second floor permits. Permits. Permitting. I see it. No, I don't. Street permits and moving. <laughs> no, this is marriage certificates. You know what? That's probably street permits this way. Uh, from right there, we can. Floor one and a half? Yeah, there's the auditing office up there. Yeah, we get it the outside right from over there. I'll go find some pigs. Dude, wait, that was on The only thing I'm going to post is ditching this. From what street, though? Like where the stairs are coming up from Government Center? Oh, up there. So up here. Go up. Uh-huh, go up, up, and then you're going to go right up. Oh, that half upstairs? Yeah. Okay. So it's from the third floor? Yeah. This is the second third floor. Okay, we got to go to the third stool.
Thank you. Thank you. I still, I should practice, you know, listening and doing an accent for like a week before I came out so that I wouldn't be New Jersey. You know? Oh, hey. What happened? Short hair, blonde mask out of the permitting office. I, I feel like that's... Yeah, that's... How do we get out of here? Oh, we go up this way? Okay, we gotta go up these stairs. I think we uh, solved the problem. Holy smokes. Who'd have known? Who'd have thunked? All right, entrance, entrance, entrance. It's over this way, I believe. I think that's, we're gonna have to put her in this video here, this lady here, the mask. Maybe they're gonna poop. All right. All right, fellas. See you later. <laughs> it's nice. And that's the reason I stopped you today.